just found. Wow, where'd you find that? It's a secret. Come on, Bobby. Tell me where you found it. It was sticking out of Miss Washington's purse. What? Bobby, that's not yours. That's stealing. No, it's not. It was hanging out of her purse. She'll think she lost it. Bobby, please put it back. No, she won't know what happened to it. Here, I'll have it with you. I don't know about it. Students, I need to talk with you. Earlier, I had some money in my purse that I was taking to the bank after school. At lunch, I noticed my purse was moved out from under my desk, and I noticed that my money was gone. Does anyone know anything about this? Miss Washington, Miss Washington. Hannah had a bunch of money, and she gave me half. No, I didn't. Bobby said she took it from your purse and gave me half of it. Nuh-uh. I told her that I wanted to tell you. So she gave me half so I wouldn't tattle. Okay, students. Students, it's time for recess. Bobby, you and Hannah stay with me. Bobby, what are you doing? I am not going to get in trouble for this. Girls, where is the money right now? Right here. Here you go. 20, 40, 60, 70. 75, 80. Bobby, thank you so much for being honest. Now you go on ahead outside with the rest of the students. Thank you. Miss Washington, I didn't take the money from your purse. Then who did? Bobby called me over and said that she found it. Now why would Bobby lie to me? You go stay at your desk until the end of recess, and you will sit out recess all next week as well. Yes, Miss Washington. Miss Washington, I need to talk to you. Yes, Hannah? I want to apologize for what happened Friday. I never should have taken the money that wasn't mine, and I don't mind taking the punishment for what I've done. Thank you for being honest with me. Miss Washington, I need to tell you something. Yes, Bobby? Miss Washington, I lied to you. Hannah didn't take your money. I did. I saw it sticking out of your purse, and I wanted it. When Hannah tried to stop me, I gave her half, hoping that she wouldn't get me in trouble. But when you asked, I was very scared. Well, thank you, Bobby, for being honest and telling me the truth. Hannah, I'm sorry I didn't believe you. You girls understand it's not good to take something that doesn't belong to you. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Girls, go on back to your seat. Why did you do that? I was taking the punishment. I'm sorry I got you in trouble, but when I saw that you were willing to accept my punishment, I couldn't let you do that. Could you ever forgive me? Sure, I can forgive you. Would you be my friend again? I never stopped being your friend. I just realized that there's no greater love than someone who will take the punishment for someone else.